Royal Pirates exhibit here at National Geographic is a history of the Witta, uh, which is a ship that sunk about 300 years ago. And one of the National Geographic explorers actually went down 25 years ago, found the Witta, and has spent the last couple of decades bringing treasure up. The, the Real Pirates exhibit is actually, it's very cool because you don't often get a chance to see true artifacts and a little bit of an understanding of the personality behind it. National Geographic got involved with Heavy Seas uh, because Ken actually got in touch with me. He said, you know, I think that we should do this event. We've got this really great beer and this theme and we love beer too. So uh, we figured that it was a perfect fit and uh, it, it just made sense for us. We're trying to reach a younger audience. We thought that this kind of event would really sort of make people aware that we have this space here and we have these fun exhibits and we also do cool programming. So we originally created Heavy Seas to be the, the, the brand that was our bigger beers. Now we, you know, we, we, uh, we put a lot of pirate character into it and a lot of nautical character into it. So it was a good segue, but it took on a life of its own. So we just kind of decided after a little while that we were going to roll with it. The thing Heavy Seas has done with their whole stable of brands is brand it around nautical themes, which includes pirates, and they've done a great job because they're doing the, the same styles of beer that would have been drank by people during that period. They're making it big beers, they're making high alcohol beers, they're making big beers that are full of flavor, and they're making beers that people in colonial times would have clamored for. This, is, this, this occasion is going to help sort of solidify and play into where we want to take the brand in the future. One, because this is, this is Washington, D.C., this is the nation's capital, so it's a nice thing to be able to sort of dig a little bit deeper here and then also to help carry that sort of pirate-themed message. Secondly, um, we're in the process of redeveloping our entire hospitality area, so we're going to take some design elements from this and incorporate it into that. And third, you know, it's just anytime you, you take something which is a romanticized thing and you can begin to add elements of authenticity, that's cool.